I'm Brittany, this is Eddie, and welcome to Gay Watch, where we watch gay things. Today's episode is Space Seed. It's the one where Khan arrives, and outside of him taking over the ship, I don't remember. But it's fine, we're gonna hit synced, I'm gonna hit play, and we're gonna have the great old time that we usually have. It's fine, it's fine. Pull up the episode on any device you want. Compare your episode's runtime with the runtime provided down in this video's description box and make sure that they are identical or close to it. Pause the episode at zero minutes, zero seconds, right at the beginning, and then I will give you a countdown that sounds like this. Three, two, one, play. And when I say play, you'll hit play. Hi, me from the future, hopping back in to explain something really quick in the event that I did in fact screw myself by leaving the episode audio on while I was recording the first 15 or so minutes of this episode, in case that means I cannot include it, which it probably will, then I will just pick up where I turned the audio off and I will, I will have the time code in the bottom start accordingly if I can figure out how to do that. So hopefully it will just mean that you have to skip to a certain timestamp that maybe I'll be flashing on this screen now. The beginning of this episode might be missing, but hopefully we'll be able to just pick up and keep going. I accidentally left the desktop audio on until now. So here's hoping that doesn't fuck me over. As then I left the audio of the episode on until now. Well, 72 superhumans should be just enough to probably take over the ship, yeah. I thought he did have... I didn't think he was like Madonna. I thought he had an I thought he had a first name. Oh yeah. I don't know if like giving him all this information is like the best idea. Not really. I don't know. Hello again. Well, 
Well, yeah. But, uh, yeah. I mean, I feel like it's pretty definite. Oh, that's comforting. Yeah, you mean kind of like... Yeah. Unfortunately, they weren't on the planet, but like they would know that. Oh god, now we get to watch him just mind fucker. Ugh. I mean, she was like already halfway there from the way that she was gazing lovingly at his unconscious body, but like... Um, who the fuck asked you? Okay, manipulative. Like, that is totally how abusers do it. They make you think there's something wrong with you. And then they fix it. Ugh. Space melon! Whoever came up with his wardrobe, I hope they got paid. Oh, that is supposed to be literally him. I, I was in... Uh... 
Ew. Get away. Oh, 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 I feel so bad for her. Oh, she was like right in the prime place to be manipulated. And it just happens. Ugh. He's Oh yeah. Real social. You're not wrong. Mm, no, oh, oh, I'm so faint. Oh, my superhuman muscular body. I don't like him either, Kirk. Who's texting me? Ah. That would be the fiance. He does have a full name. I just remembered it. This is directed at him, by the way. She is very much purely a victim in this. He's so sickeningly good at it. This is one of the more fucked up things I've seen from 60s entertainment.
this is really like a blueprint handbook how to and how to spot guide of absolutely fucking emotional abusers abusers in general probably but specifically of the mind fuckery kind I mean that is practically textbook Ah, I thought I remembered it correctly, yeah. A quarter of the world? Hang on. Oh, yeah. Totally. Spock is so precious. He's so precious. He's so precious. Oh, God, now he's in a uniform. Yeah. I was about to say, like, nope, just told me everything. We are, like, tripling your guard and we're throwing you in the brig. At least that's what I would do. You're not going to put one guard, one guard on his door. Like, at least two. Is that like a strength summoning thing? I'm guessing so. That was an impressive jump. I hope that guy got paid. I mean, he went right ass over tea kettle. I'd look really confused at her too. Oh, what is that? What was that Vulcan ass move? Vulcan adjacent, but you know. Oh God, now they're all swimmers. Now why'd they leave the women in the gold lame fishnets? 
But the men get uniforms. Well done, Khan. Uh, yeah. No, fine, hurt Scotty. That's fine. That'll endear you to me real quick. This is what happens when you give him textbooks. He fucked us good. Mm hmm. Oh, great. Well, uh, everybody gonna pass out. Of course. You're gonna, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Look at the group of people he's talking to. That's right. That's my boy. Oh, that look. That look. You Better not fucking hurt my girl. Ooh. Ooh, we all gonna kill you now. Ooh, she might kill you. Don't act like you're nice. They already had heroic camaraderie. Fucker. Oh God, that's right. That's where Kirk is. Fuck.
I forget exactly what the fuck is happening, though. Yeah, but what exactly is happening? I think he I think he's just being kept at very very low oxygen levels. I thank you for the, yeah. Yes, they will. Yes, they will. Decompression. I only vaguely know what that means. Oh, that's right. I forgot that she kind of comes to her senses. That's got to suck. You're like, I fucking might. What's Ahura doing? I mean, she wasn't going to be doing it for long. Great. God damn it. Oh, this fight isn't going to go well. He's a fucking genetically engineered. This isn't going to go well. Or it's not even going to start. I mean, Kirk's also not an idiot.
Unless everyone's about to explode and then Kirk's going to fight him anyway. Yeah, that's about how that goes. Now there's a move. You know, once again, I hope the stunt guys got paid that day. What the fuck is that? Well, whatever handle it is, that sure as hell helped. Much better. We're all going to live. All right. Yes, thank you. That they would probably just take over anyway. Could you clue us in for those of us who haven't read Milton? You're going with him. Oh, or she chooses to go. So came back to her senses enough to help Kirk. <laughs> but still fucked enough to go with him. Thank you, Scotty. Of course he would say that. Yeah. It will be extremely interesting. Yeah. Uh-huh. Highly interesting. Well, that's it for Space Seed. Khan was even more of a fucking dick bag than I remember. He, I, uh, 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 but still a great episode as always. Like I really, they did a really good job at making Khan a truly formidable opponent. And like, yeah, they kind of had to deal with him real quick for the end of the episode, 
But putting him on a planet was a really, like, interesting... Probably didn't see that coming when you first watched it thing. Wow. Yeah. Gross. He's gross. I hate him. I hate him a lot. Like, he's great, but I hate him. That's it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. I will be here next week with This Side of Paradise. And please remember to take care of yourself.